Hey guys, today I'm going to give you a review of Woodruff Golf Course, my favorite golf course. Been playing the golf course since I was a child, so don't expect an unbiased review. But this will be my first in a series of course reviews in the Chicagoland area. So check it out and uh, hope you find something that maybe entices you to go out and play. Five holes to go, just play 13. Need to palm away in, yeah. gotta hit more greens. Woodruff Golf Course is a par 68, no par 5s on the course, plays just under 5,700 yards. Uh, the course opened up in 1926. Uh, it's the oldest of three Joliet Park District courses. It's a scenic, well manicured course, has some sweeping elevation changes and small greens with quite a bit of undulation on those greens. Um, the course is normally in really good condition from the tees to the greens. The course record is 59, is, is over 60 years old. So even with all the new technology of today and everyone hitting it longer, and uh, that course record of 59, 9 under par is held up for over 60 years. So the course is tree-lined, and there's a creek that winds throughout the back nine uh, that can kind of uh, wreak havoc with some of the shorter hitters. The signature hole is number 12. It's a par 3. You tee off a cliff and you hit it through a chute down between some bunkers. And you really need a precise shot. And, you know, if you miss the green left or right, you definitely don't want to be short sided on this hole. The most scenic hole would be number 10. It's a really beautiful winding fairway once you get beyond the creek on this hole and the green is a little elevated also the most difficult hole is number 11 uh, it's a dogleg right there's a flag in the middle of the fairway that kind of lines you up to where where you know that the uh, the dogleg starts uh, but there's trouble right there's there's out of bounds right there's a, 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 a penalty area on your left and is really a, a really good risk reward hole because if you lay up short of that flag you leave yourself 170 yards to a really small green and if you hit it left or right there's trouble on both sides more trouble on the right but if you miss the green left you have a really really difficult um, shot onto that really tiny green and it's hard to even hold the green if you miss it left. The best birdie opportunity is on number six. It's a, a downhill par four, 268 yards from the black tees. So it's really a great birdie opportunity. You know, longer hitters will, you know, hit hybrids and maybe fairway woods. And it gives even shorter hitters an opportunity to, to either drive a green or, or get close to that green. Probably my favorite hole is 16, which is a dogleg left. And again, it's only 338 from the black tees. Dogleg left, one of the biggest greens on the course. There's bunkers on both sides, and it's a fall off at the beginning of the green. It's a really beautiful hole, uh, especially during sunset. There you have it guys, there's my review of Woodruff Golf Course. I hope you got something out of the video. If you have any questions, comments, leave them down in the comments section. Until next time, Mr. Shore Hitter, out. My game's obscene now, hooks and big fades, it's not my day now. Why did I play now? Just clear my head, get back in this, an outside shot, you still can win this.